In this code sample, we have a simple activity. It's a class that extends activity. Here we create a linear layout and we place a web view and a button on top of that linear layout and the linear layout is being set as the content view of the activity. Now, now the button has a listener so that whenever the button is clicked this line this line of code is executed and over here you can see that we actually invoke load URL on the web view object load URL is a function we can pass over a URL address we want the uh, web view um, to treat just as placing a URL address inside the URL address small window every web browser has so that if over here I pass over file android underscore asset and then demo3.html it actually means loading the demo3.html file we have inside the assets folder demo3.html uh, this specific string if you write it then it refers to the assets folder now whenever we place a URL address that starts with uh, JavaScript and then this character the code afterwards is simply executed you can take a simple web browser and place inside a URL address something that starts with uh, JavaScript and then this character the code afterwards will be executed so that if that web browser at that moment has a function its name is increment then you actually call that function by placing this URL address now here in this code sample demo3 presents a simple div with a number and here we have a function its name is increment and whenever increment is invoked this number is incremented incremented by one so whenever I press the button count the number displayed on top is incremented by one because whenever I pr press the button the, the bu button count this code is executed and this code invokes the increment function that increments the number so let's execute this code sample this is the emulator and now when I press the button you can see that the value is incremented by 1